and Julia Sondu, showing you where development is happening. Please come and join us. Tanzania awards $2.2 billion contract for standard gauge railway project. The 2,561 km rail line will connect the Indian Ocean port of Dar es Salaam to Mwanza on Lake Victoria. Tanzania has reached a $2.2 billion contract with a Chinese firm for the construction of a final section of a standard gauge railway, SGR, which will connect the country's main port with its neighboring countries. With eventual spurs to Burundi, the Democratic Republic of Congo, DRC, Rwanda and Uganda, the 2,561 km rail line will connect the Indian Ocean port of Dar es Salaam to Mwanza on Lake Victoria, reported AFP. Tanzania President Amir Saluhu Hassan said that the construction of the final section of the Standard Gauge Railway, SGR, from Tabora to Kagoma in western Tanzania is expected to be completed in 2026, nine years after it started. Upon completion of the SGR, Tanzania will be in a better position to utilize its strategic geographical positioning to facilitate cross-border trade, she stated. The investment of Tanzania in the SGR has now reached $10.04 billion, including the current contract, according to Hassan. Upon full commencement of operations, the new rail line is anticipated to lower cargo transportation costs between the Dar es Salaam port and the DRC from a minimum of $6,000 per tonne to around $4,000. Hassan further added, we have to borrow for this important infrastructure and other sustainable development projects because we don't have enough local resources. Tanzania's railway system consists of two existing networks, of which one will link the East African nation to Zambia and the other to Kenya and Uganda. Tanzania Standard Gauge Railway The Tanzania Standard Gauge Railway is a railway system, under construction, linking the country to the neighboring countries of Rwanda and Uganda, and through these two, to Burundi and the Democratic Republic of the Congo, as part of East African Railway Master Plan. The new Standard Gauge Railway, SGR, is intended to replace the old, inefficient meter gauge railway system. This 1,435 mm, 4 feet 8 plus 1 half in, railway line is intended to ease the transfer of goods between the port of Dar es Salaam and the cities of Kigali, in Rwanda and subsequently to Bujumbura, in Burundi, and to Goma, in the Democratic Republic of the Congo. From the lake port of Mwanza, surface water ferries are expected to transport goods between Mwanza and Port Bell and Bakasa Inland Port, in Kampala, Uganda's capital city. The SGR system in Tanzania, in conformity with neighboring Rwanda and Uganda is designed to use electricity to power its locomotives. The SGR is expected to accommodate passenger trains traveling at 160 km 99 miles per hour and cargo trains traveling at 120 km 75 miles per hour. Phase 1 Dar es Salaam Morogoro section The first phase has been completed in April 2022 currently in live testing phase. It covers the distance of 300 km 186 miles from the city Dar es Salaam to Morogoro. This section, measuring 300 km 186 miles, was contracted to a 50-50 consortium comprising Yapi Merkezi of Turkey and Mota Engel of Portugal. Construction began in April 2017 and Yapi Merkezi have been showing the progress of construction with monthly video reports on YouTube. Partial funding for this section, amounting to US $1.2 billion, was borrowed from the Export Credit Bank of Turkey. There are six stations, Dar es Salaam, Pugu, Soga, Ruvu, and Gerengere and Morogoro. Three trains will make daily round trips. With infrastructure complete electrical test, and live train trials began in late April, 2022. Phase 2 Morogoro Makatopora section The second phase covers a distance of approximately 426 km, 265 miles, from Morogoro via Dodoma to Makatopora in Manyoni district, Singida region. In September 2018, the government of Tanzania secured a soft loan from Standard Chartered Bank, amounting to US $1.46 billion, for the funding of this section of the country's SGR. 
This section was also contracted to the consortium that is constructing the Dar es Salaam Morogoro section. The stations after Morogoro will be Amkata, Kiloza, Kidete, Galway, Agunda, Dodoma, Bahi and Makatopora. As the end of July 2022, the work has reached 90% and will be completed by December 2022. Phase 3. The third phase will cover from Makatupura to Tabora which includes 7 stations and 294 km of mainline and 74 km of intersections for a total of 368 km at a cost of $1.9 billion, 4.41 trillion Tanzanian shillings. The contract has been awarded to Yapi Marchese who has constructed the first two phases. The foundation stone was placed in April, 2022 with work to start immediately. Phase 4. Tabora Izaka Section. The fourth phase will cover Tabora to Izaka, 130 km, 81 miles. As of August 2022, the Tabora Izaka section it has been awarded to Yapi Marke and work is in the mobilization stage. Phase 5. Izaka Mwanza section. This section, measuring approximately 341 kilometers, 212 miles, from Izaka to the city of Mwanza, on the southern shores of Lake Victoria. In January 2021, the Citizen newspaper reported that two Chinese companies had been selected to construct this section of the SGR. China Civil Engineering Construction CCEC, and China Railway Construction Company CRCC, were selected to carry out the work at a contract price of approximately TZS, 3 trillion, approximately US $1.3 billion. Later that month, the East African reported that Tanzania had secured funding worth $1.32 billion through the government of China for the purpose of building this section of the SGR. This section is under construction. Phase 6. Tabora Kigma. This section, measuring approximately 506 kilometers, 314 miles, from Tabora to Kagoma on the eastern shores of Lake Tanganyika. The contract was signed on December 20, 2022 between the Government of Tanzania and China Civil Engineering Construction Corporation, CCECC, and China Railway Construction Company, CRCC for the construction of the railway. Izaka Rasumo section. This stretch of the SGR is component of the Izaka Kigali Standard Gauge Railway and measures approximately 371 kilometers, 231 miles. Construction of this section is budgeted at 942 million United States dollars. In April 2018, the East African newspaper reported that the World Bank had expressed its willingness to fund the Izaka Kigali Standard Gauge Railway. Funding. Up until February 2020, the government of Tanzania was using locally generated funds and short-term temporary loans to fund the construction of the first two phases of this Standard Gauge Railway project. In February 2020, the government received a syndicated loan worth US $1.46 billion, towards the completion of the first two phases of the national SGR. The financing package has standard charted as lead arranger and the export credit agencies of Denmark and Sweden as major funding sources. The combined contract value for the first two phases is US$2.35 billion United States dollars with US$950 million worth of funding to be organized by the Tanzania Ministry of Finance and the remaining US$1.45 billion United States dollars by Yapi Merkezi. This is the end of our program today. See you on Intervlog same time tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to get new video updates. Thank you for watching Intervlog. Thank you.